Hey everybody, what's going on? Your host AMF1534 here. Welcome to Let's Play Little League Baseball Championship Series. So a lot of you guys are thinking, this is really random, but it's not actually. Considering that the, uh, the Little League World Series is happening as we speak, actually, it's been going on for the last probably week and a half or so, I thought it'd be cool just to do a little, uh, a little series of this. I, I came across this Little League game um, on my NES library not too long ago, and I was like, that'd be, that'd be kind of cool. It actually uses the same gaming engine as um, Baseball Stars, so that's immediately awesome. And uh, I mean, I, I love baseball. I'm a big, I'm a big sports fan. I played all the different stages of, of Little League Baseball when I was a kid, so I did T-ball and minors and majors and seniors and juniors and the whole, the whole thing. So I thought it'd be kind of cool. I mean, it's, it's a short little game. I think that you only play like four games. So yeah, let's, let's, uh, let's do it. Let's start up a new one. The part that sucks, though, is that I'm an Oregonian, and uh, they don't have a team from Oregon. They don't really have anybody from the from the Northwest whatsoever. So we'll go with the next best thing, and I'll be California. The old Cali Dream in here. And I think that it will probably choose the rest of the teams for me. So I'm playing against Japan. Oh, I'm not playing against Japan. I was like, God, throw me under the bus already, why don't you? Ooh, Japan, oh, Japan won, despite only having three hits. Texas and Chinese Taipei. Chinese Taipei is always good. Ooh, but Texas beat them. Yeah, by the way, for those of you that don't know the whole thing about Little League Baseball, you only play six innings, so it's definitely not nearly the same as it is with, like, Major League Baseball, so that's one reason why these games are going to be a lot shorter and totally awesome. Nice, we beat the Canadians. Cool. That's what I'm talking about. Korea and Italy. My friend's from South Korea, actually. And the Koreans won. Who am I playing, damn it? Arizona and Florida, getting into the U.S. stuff. Arizona, oh, I was like, they played one inning? No, they went into they went into extra innings, even. Splendid. Here we go. I'm playing as Puerto Rico. Their teams are good. Yikes. Well, we'll see how this goes. I'm the away team, so I get to bat first. Awesome. All right. I don't need to change the order of anything, so we're good. I have Biff Tannen from Back to the Future. That's that's a great way to start this. I don't really know what the whole skill thing's about. I'm guessing it probably has something to do that if it's higher, then they're probably going to be able to, you know, hit the ball harder, run faster, and the whole thing. I just really hope I don't strike out on the first batter. That would be really, really crappy. Brimo? What kind of name is that for a kid? If I ever named my kid Brimo, I would have him be homeschooled, because I wouldn't want to put him through the trouble of going to public school with a name like Brimo. Oh, come on, get through the hole. There you go. He gets the single. Look at Bruce. A little chubby chub. These, do these bats look rather small to you, or is it just me? They don't look very big. There you go, another single. I'm trying to put a couple of runs up on the board now, because usually they start they start getting into their groove as the game wears on, which is bad news. It's Sid Phillips from Toy Story. With a pop-up. That's just great. That's supposed to be my best player, too, damn it. How the hell are you gonna only hit a two-foot pop fly? Old Tom Chambers decided to go from Little League Baseball to jumping over people in the NBA because they're the exact same person and everything. Oh, and he gets the K. Yeah, you hit your you hit your bat on the on the plate there, buddy. All right, Emilio Estevez. That's just lovely. And he's going to he's going to ground out to me. I wish they would have had an Oregon team in here, but I I understand it. I mean, Oregon's definitely not one of the more well-known states in in the world. So they would they would pick California. I don't have anything against that. My dad was from California. Ah, I can I can slide. This is good. Slow ball. Ooh. Let's see if I can get him with a slow one. Or he's just gonna cremate it. Shit. Come on. Get to the ball. You slow piece of shit. Oh my god. Oh no, you don't. You're not gonna get there. My. My center, my center fielder has a cannon for an arm. Pepe Le Pew? I didn't know Pepe Le Pew was a, was a Puerto Rican. There we go. No harm done. 
Bill. It's Bill from Hank. Uh, from, from Hank. Uh, Bill from King of the Hill. Why do you keep calling me Bill? Lee Trevino, the golfer. I'm gonna have this guy steal second. There you go. Perfect. I mean, you're gonna get out, but that's all right. We move the runner. That's that's playing small ball right there. Good old Randy Travis. Yeah, yeah, you you waste that. Shit. That was not a very good idea. God damn it. Tyrone? And he's white? How does that work? How the hell are you gonna have a white kid named Tyrone? He must be a ga a total gangster. Let's be honest. You can get there, you can get there, you can get there! Yeah! Get that stolen base, son. At least now you have a chance. Watch, I'm gonna strike out again. God damn it. Both of my fat, small left-handers have struck out. Uh-oh. Get back there to the fence! Okay. Yeah, warning track power. You got nothing on this. Andreas Galarraga? No way. Andreas Galarraga was fat and out of shape. And I think he may have done steroids. Man, I, I, love, I loved Little League, man. The only thing I didn't like about it was the fact that you couldn't actually, like, get a lead off, like, while they were still on the windup and everything. You just had, you had to wait for the ball to pass, um, you had to wait for the ball to pass uh, home plate first before you could steal. Nobody ever stole bases. The only way you ever stole a base was if it, like, went to the backstop and the catcher was, like, too, you know, slow and out of shape to ever throw you out. So you're just like, oh, yeah, I can pretty much just jog in there, no big deal. Are we going to have a pitcher's duel in this one? That's what it looks like, because nobody is getting any type of significant contact here. At least they only play six innings, though. I mean, that's, that's kind of one thing that makes it a little bit easier. Man, I am just, I am not doing so hot. We're, we're just going back and forth. At least I have four hits. They don't, they only have one. It's kind of weird seeing, like, Little League players nowadays, like, compared to when I was little. Like, I just, I just saw, um, they just showed, like, a preview for one of the games being played today, and one of the kids, he's fucking 12 years old, and he's six feet tall. Like, that never happened when I was, when I was, when I was that age. Like, if you had anybody that was, like, five foot five being 12 years old, they were like, oh man, you're pretty big. But no, like, you get all these kids that are, like, 6'1 and 6'2, and they're, like, 230 pounds. They might as well just be, oh, is that a home run? Is that a home run? Yeah, baby! It's gone! <laughs> and we apparently have cheerleaders with huge tits. <laughs> I don't remember seeing that type of thing at uh, during the Little League in my day. Apparently, yes, we have high school cheerleading squads now. But yeah, fucking Sid Phillips driving in the big run. That could be that could be the difference. Damn it, Tom Chambers. Actually, this this could be more like Tom Cruise because Tom Cruise is really short. That's why they have to you know shoot upwards angles at him all the time because he's like five foot two. I'm pretty sure that my mom's taller than he is. All right, Bill. William Tell, what do you got? Get me a homer. Wham! A homer! Or a ground out. That's, that's even better. Lee Trevino? Or is this General Lee? Or maybe... Maybe, uh, I don't know, maybe some other guy named Lee. There we go. That's gonna be a single. I like how their, their outfielders are always right there. Like, if I were to hit that down the line in real life, that would probably go all the way to the fence. But no. Oh, no. They are, they are on top of it. I'm stealing second. I'm going for it. See, in this game, they have it to where you can... Oh, make it! There you go. See, with this one, they have it as soon as he lets go of the ball. Like, back when I was... Um, Merlo? Is he a, is he a fine-aged wine? Like, some of these guys' names sound more like they'd be, like, Italian or something. God damn it. That's now three short, fat, blonde kids that have struck out. That's just great. 
That's alright though, they can get my they can have my guys strike out all they want, because I still hit a home run. I yacked that thing. Ooh. Oh! Nice play! He gets up on one foot. Man, the second baseman is just getting all the work today. He's been doing everything. Alright, Tyrone. Let's see if you can uh, actually be of use this time. I would love to have you on base right about now. I should probably not swing at things that are way out of the strike zone. <laughs> I mean, little kids do that all the time, though. You get ones where they throw it and it's like all the way up at, you know, eye level and you still swing at it anyways just because you don't want to... You don't want to have your coach being like, Why didn't you swing at that? It's like, uh... It's like fucking what's-his-name from, from the movie Signs. It felt wrong not to swing. Here we go. Come on now. Merlot's skill is two as a pitcher. We should be totally teeing off of him right now. But instead, he's already struck out one person. So that's that's not gonna that's not gonna cut it for me. Uh, and the pitch, and a ball. I wonder if like if you get hit by a pitch, if it shows them like crying hardcore, because that always happens in little league. You get a kid that gets hit in the leg, and he's just like, "Oh my god, my life is over." I think my entire body's broken. I mean, in, like, the Little League World Series, though, I guess it's a little more understandable, because some of those kids are throwing fucking fast. They're throwing, like, you know, 68 miles an hour, which is, like, the, the equivalent in the major leagues of, like, a 90-mile-an-hour fastball, so I guess it makes sense. The second baseman, man, he is just, he is killing right now. And then I say that, and they finally hit one over here. Oh! Diving catch! God damn it, this team is awesome. I mean, they're only awesome because I'm controlling them, but still. They got that, that West Coast talent right now. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him the gas face right here. Manny Ramirez is gonna strike out, or he's just gonna ground up to third. God, that's a terrible throw. That is just an awful, awful throw. I mean, let's be honest, a Little League Diamond is pretty small, and if you can't even make it to the first baseman, that's gonna... that's not, that's not good. At that point, you should probably be sitting on the bench. Or, uh, you know, riding the pine. Or any other term that you could that you could have for not being on the field. I've had a lot of base runners. Aw, oh, here we go. Sid Phillips is back up with, a re with some re... Uh, with, the, with the revenge of the Mohicans. Good old... Montezuma's revenge here. Steal! God, that would have been another homer. That would have been way gone. Holy shit. And now he's probably going to strike out. Let's be honest. Exactly. Is he going to get a strike him out, throw him out? Absolutely not. All my white kids are faster than their, uh... They're taking advantage of some very bad play at catcher. It's all about the small ball, baby. Shit, get back. Really? You're gonna pop it up? Great move there, buddy. You're gonna pop it up to the catcher. Alright, Mr. Dotrieve. Let's see what you got. Oh, it's got a chance! It's got a chance! It doesn't have a chance. God damn it. I hate when that happens. It, it totally looks like you're gonna be able to get it, and it ends up not even being close. This is definitely not a hitter's park. I'm pretty sure that was a foul ball, but I guess not. I guess, you know, picking up the ball when it's clearly not in fair play is still considered fair by these standards. Bottom of the sixth, they're going to have to score at least one run here. Look at that sliding stop, my god. Sign these kids up for the major leagues right now. They can't even, they're down to their final out. And they end it in the same way that it's been going the whole day, grounding out to the second baseman. I'm pretty sure that he accounted for, like, every single one of the, uh, or at least, I'm gonna say probably about half the outs in this, in this game. But there we go, my friends. California has defeated Puerto Rico one to nothing at the merit of Sid Phillips' long, probably 180-foot home run. Because <laughs> their fences aren't very long at all. Look at that. Who would have number 94 on a jersey? I mean, is this hockey, or are they like a defensive lineman? Yeah, good old U.S. of A. 
This is good old America. All right, everybody. Well, this is your host, AMF1534, saying thank you guys for watching the very first round of Let's Play Little League Baseball Championship Series. When we come back next time, we're taking on Hawaii. So you guys take care, and I'll see you next time.